The property tab currently offers two options, the ability to set properties for specific entities and the ability to delete properties of specific entities. What we're going to do is exit out of the property field and we're going to look at the drawing. Currently we have three grills which have been placed at three different heights, six foot bottom, eight foot bottom, and 15 foot bottom. And what we'd like to do is we'd like to set the properties in this particular case, the bottom elevation to a specific value or height. And to do that, we're going to highlight the entities on our drawing. We're going to come into the auto property icon on the automatic panel. We're first going to choose our selection parameters. We're going to choose grill current selection. So all the currently selected grills. And we're going to come over here to the property tab and we're going to go and make sure we've got set checked. We're going to come over here and we're going to click once on this field and Practicad is going to open up a drop down menu. And here we're going to have a list of properties that we can currently use for the set automatic. In this particular tutorial we're going to set the bottom elevation to a specific value and here we're going to type in 120. Remember we're typing in 120 here because on this desktop the units of the drawing happen to be in decimal. If you are using architectural you'll be able to type in 10 foot. So we're going to type in 120 inches for 10 foot. So right now this property automatic is going to set bottom elevation of all grills currently selected on the drawing to 120 inches or 10 foot. We're now going to press OK and when we do that you can see that Practicat has adjusted the height of all three grills and of course it's reflected in the tags. So we can use automatics to set properties of anything that we have as a choice underneath our property automatics.